had a couple people ask me how to do a poster session online and there are lots of different ways and here's one that some people found interesting so this is just a, a fairly vanilla WordPress install on Rampages um, but I wanted to show you kind of how the pieces work and how it all fits together um, not super pretty right now but uh, but I think it'll prove the point. So we have some directions or whatever on the home page. We're not requiring students to become users or anything like that. They just click on the submit your poster button. Um, they're going to enter their name or whatever data that you want and you can hide this or display it. It's really up to you. So here I am fake person and my fake poster title. Now I'm going to choose my PDF which case I chose a fairly large file and then I'm going to choose a giant mp3 this is 35 minutes and 51 megabytes so it's pretty big uh, and then you can have some other stuff like if you wanted to give them a topic um, from categories to drop down or a class designation whatever you want there um, or nothing um, you can structure this really in a lot of different ways. You could have them write a summary, etc. It's whatever pieces you want in the form can be put there. And then when they submit, what it's going to do is create a WordPress post. You can see down below in the corner there, that's the uploading. Because this is kind of giant, it's going to take a minute. Um, so we can see it churning on there though. But this creates a WordPress post automatically. Um, like I said, no need to learn WordPress, no need for anything like that. And the final 5%, come on. And I would encourage not to be quite so giant. Um, but what it's saying here is thanks for submitting. You see the poster submissions below and there's ours, fake poster title. And then bam, we have the PDF, we have the audio. We can display who submitted it or not, like I said. There's the audio file that you can move through. And this is the PDF, which you can also zoom in on and pan around and do whatever. Um, but hopefully that gets a rough idea of what's going on. Uh, another piece that can be kind of fun is like for this one, I also attached a rubric and you could do rubrics there and have students uh, review this stuff in any way that you would like um, uh, in addition to leaving comments and things like that. So there's lots of stuff you can do, lots of choices you can have. It's really uh, very customizable and a super quick thing to be able to create.